Welcome to Pokemon Freak 16 Diamond Adventures Part 64 Galactic Boss Cyrus. Okay, now I have beaten these two Jupiter and Mars, and King will heal up my Pokemon, which is very helpful, and I'll just be quiet now. Okay, now the red chain crumbled away and Mesprix is like over oh, chilling with me and uh, Cyrus says I'm going to crush you so let's take him on boss of team galactic but since last time this dude is strong he has gotten much stronger much training up here in my corner. He's now as a hunch crow, level 45. And this thing, uh, it has high attack and it has dark pulse and power good drill pack and some other attack. But it can hit you. But I think uh, hunch crow is his lowest Pokemon. He's using a super potion, why did he do that? That won't help him, yes it won't. It will, like I say, just brine. But it won't help him. Now I realize. And he switches to his Gyarados. Gyarados. Which is a new addition to his team. Also on level 45. I used Bubble Beam. So I just switch. And Gyarados knows some um, devastating moves. So you get an Ice Fang, Earthquake, Giga Impact, and uh, Aqua Tail. Which is all attacks, attacking ones. And if you're trying to use uh, Luxury, which is in uh, lower 40, under level 40, it will hit you with Earthquake. And I'm putting a Mega Volume here and I don't realize why I do that. Okay, it's in Dragon Claw. Surprisingly, I had more speed than Gyarados. It's this Giga Impact. It's very powerful, but it has a recharge when it has used that. So let's put out Eliquil. Let's spark it. And it has more speed than me. As I thought. This spark. Hope we do the work. Da I don't think so. Yes it did. Stupid camera. Not the best one, but it's only what I got. And his next Pokemon is his Weavile. The evolved form of Sneasel, which I will eventually get. And Weavile is pretty strong. It has Brick Break, Night Slash, Ice Punch, and some other attack. And it has Pressure. And it's very fast. It's very fast too. I'm taking a chance here putting out all over I say no it no it's break break. But I think this will do the work. A respear, quite effective. Yeah. One it kill V Vile. You wasn't ready for that though. And he's like, uh, no, he's sending out his hunch crow again. So let's stick with Golden Aura. And 
now he uses a forest door. And I put it out. Got an aura to fight against Archdro. He just had to do that. Didn't do more than half. That's disappointing. The the embargo does say no. I can't use any items for five turns, and I don't know if just on a golden aura or just any of my Pokemon. But I knocked out the. Uh, that Hunch Crow and Golden Arrow leveled up. And now he sends out his last Pokemon, his Crobat. And this thing is very, very fast. It's one of the fastest Pokemon in the whole game. I know that because I got one in level 100. Uh, I admit mean that you have pushed me to, to this extreme on my uh, emerald it's very fast and it knows a uh, confused ray ear slash bite and cross poison uh, ear slash and bite can flinch you which is very annoying and cross poison can poison you the spark I will get uh, that was pretty nice. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Very nice, paradise. Now I will hit first. This, this can be. It's not possible that I lose. Realize that I will. Do, I will beat you, but not for this turn. But next turn, I promise you, Cyrus. Crobat is paralyzed, so it can't move. It gets a perfect chance here for Elk Wolf. Yeah, you're down, Cyrus! I will defeat you! You didn't crush me, I crushed you! And that's it, the boss of Team Galactic! And you probably want... Power! The mythology! You want... Probably you want your Pokemon in higher level than mine. And now that you defeat the Cyrus, you will go up and fight Dialga. Oh!